until I finally said yes that I really knew what I had said yes to. I wasn't doing good at all. I had just dropped out of college and everything around my world was just kind of spinning. It felt like the world was in chaos and I was right there with it. And I felt so lonely and isolated. I really had no one speaking into my life and I was in a completely broken household and I just honestly just needed a complete restart. I met Elias uh, probably two or three years ago and when I met him, I knew, I knew he was a good guy. Uh, but I knew that he was curious of what to do next. It was then that Teal asked me to try out for worship, and I personally was not ready for anything like that. But I said yes anyway. Elias said yes to pretty much everything. After that point, he got plugged into the internship. He started serving in Generational Ministries. He got plugged into Who Is This Jesus? And I got connected to a group. And I was finally able to start being comfortable with being uncomfortable. I loved worshiping, I loved learning new things about music, and most importantly, I loved being able to develop a relationship with the Holy Spirit. During group, we were shown how to write the thoughts of God, and what He said to me changed my everything. You're not the guitar. You're not the piano. You're not your voice. What you are to me is a leader. It seemed like almost from each day that I saw Elias, something in him was changing. The Holy Spirit was having a massive impact. He was starting to hear the Holy Spirit in a completely new way that he had never done before. I'm never gonna know what all God has in store for me, but if I keep saying yes, I can trust and know that he will take care of me and I will continue to go further. He will give me a place to belong and he will show me how to love and he will teach me how to be the leader that he has already made me to be.